everyone welcome to another tutorial in this tutorial i will tell you about an important feature in security matrix called as how to assign or called as modern business unit security model previously there was no way to provide a pro provide access to a specific user in multiple business units but now because of this feature you can uh, assign multiple security roles across the business units although the user can tag in one business unit other business unit data can be accessed by the user through this security configuration let us see how can how we can do that first you have to go to admin.powerplatform admin center dot microsoft.com here you have to click on the environment select the environment which you want to enable for this configuration go to settings and features this is a feature so you have to enable the product and features and here we'll find the modern business unit just search modern then we'll find this uh, let me just scroll down uh, this is one and advancement let me just search uh, security yes this one so the the, uh, the option is record ownership across business units now users a single user can own multiple records across business units irrespective of which business business unit he tagged into now this feature can take several several times to enable so click on this record ownership across business unit uh, toggle package on and save it okay now once you enable this feature it will create a drop down in the business unit while assigning security roles to a user let us wait once it is configured and after a couple of seconds you will see that a drop down will be available in manage security role option now go to the again same environment and the settings and uh, expand the users area and click on users here i want to assign this user who is amit sharma and who is currently uh, tagged to business unit called as london branch i want to assign to multiple business units now click on security role when you click on manage security role you will find there is a drop down here right so business unit now shows a drop down where you can choose a business unit with a security role let's say on london branch i want to assign this user as a approval user plus in uh, india new branch i want to assign a security role called as uh, basic user and save it now this way you can choose multiple business units and select a specific security role and assign to the same user so that the security role from that business unit will be assigned to that user uh, and all the privileges and access levels will be applied to the user on that business unit right this is how a user can own records in multiple business unit uh, or across business units but this will add uh, an extra uh, field in the record uh, record owned uh, it will add a special uh, column called as owning business unit in the entity which are owned by users right so let us see how we can edit that let me go to the solution to work with let me go to a solution and how owning business unit uh, field can be added let us check let me go to the solution where i have uh, the, uh, the entities right here i have bank account entities right let's say a the person uh, can access one uh, one business unit bank accounts plus other business unit bank accounts also so what i can do then so you can go to the bank bank account form this is an entity and i can go to the form here main form and edit this edit in a new tab here you will find the owning business unit field if you click on standard 
this one so this owning business unit is the pill which is created because of this modern business unit uh, hierarchical model you can put it in the header and also you can put it on the body okay as per your uh, requirement let's save and publish you can also put it in the bank account uh, um, views let me put in the bank account view also let me go to the views and here you can in the active bank accounts i can put owning business unit so the owning business unit depends the record is owned by which business unit and we can change at any time with proper permission now i want to use this owning business unit and seven publish by default the business unit uh, owning business unit is selected as for the current owner uh, record owners uh, business unit but it can be changed at any time I close this i want to close the form also and let me open the app where we are using bank accounts Now, if you go to the bank accounts option here, you will find the active bank accounts will display the owning business unit. Okay. Now, these these are the customers, and who are the owners? Who is the owner of this cycle? Let me add owner also. Right. So now, for all these records, these are the owners, and these owners. This owner belong. This owner belongs to London branch. That's why the sorry. This owner belongs to the root business unit. And if you want to change it, you can open this and you can change it. In the uh, owner owning business unit, you can change. Let's say this record is owned by uh, owned by India New Branch. Then you can change it and save it. Right. Like that, the user. Uh, whose name is uh, what is the user we have worked on that user also can access Amit Sharma when he will log in also he can access the bank account records created in UK branch and plus in London branch also because we have assigned the multiple secret roles from multiple business units to the same user now you understand how we can uh, assign secret roles across business unit to a single user belongs to same business uh, belongs to a single business unit i hope you understand thank you everyone guys